everyone, welcome back to Style Novice. Today I'll be showing you the process of repurposing an old oak dresser into a sleek and functional piece for our baby's room to be used as a changing table. This piece has been in my husband's family since he was little and while some may be hesitant about me painting it, it has just sat in a corner of our spare bedrooms for the last five years so it may as well be repurposed, re-loved and used once again. It has beautiful detailing across the drawers in a petal-like shape intricate carving on the bottom drawer and some detailing on the sides along with these beautiful curved feet at the front. The handles were in varying states of disrepair so these were all replaced and the whole process was really simple I did this over three days or so. So the first step is to give the drawers a quick brush down. Then you want to remove any hardware and pull out each of the drawers. The first thing with any prep work is of course the sanding. You want to sand the entire outside of the dresser and the drawer fronts and for this I used a 60 grit paper on my hand sander. After sanding, wipe down the unit with some warm water with a dash of vinegar to clear any dust and debris. And you want to allow this to fully dry before going in with your primer. Here I'm applying a stain blocker as this was stained or varnished, I can't quite tell. So stain blocker prevents any stain from seeping through your final paint job and also acts as a grippy layer for your top coat to sit on, meaning that your final paint job won't chip away after some general wear and tear. If you're working with a previously painted piece, I'd still recommend using a good primer. Primers tend to dry quite quickly, this one only takes 30 minutes before you can go in with the top coat of your choice. I'm using a semi-gloss enamel in white and I'm starting by going over any detailed or carved areas with a trim brush before using a roller for a smooth and even coverage. The first coat needs to completely dry, usually around 16 to 24 hours. Then you go in with a very fine grit sandpaper in between top coats. I'm using a 120 grit, but you could go as fine as 220. A stiff brush at this point will remove any dust before applying your last and final top coat with a roller. Then it's just a matter of waiting until the next day to give everything a nice wipe down and apply any new hardware to complete your new and improved repurposed drawers. That is it for today's DIY, be sure to subscribe to see the baby's room as it all comes together. Do check out my other videos and I'll see you next time.